Hi there. Welcome to your church. Today, I'd like to talk with you about becoming a more welcoming church. Back here, we've got Jack and Sally and little Jack Jack, and they're first time guests today. Hi. You guys ready? We've got a bit of a hike. Let's do it, please. Most church members don't see their churches clearly. They think of their churches as friendly, open, welcoming. But when guests were surveyed, they typically saw church members as unfriendly, and they certainly didn't feel welcomed. Hello. The perception chasm existed because church members were indeed friendly to one another. Guests felt like they were crashing a private party. Should we get Jack Jack checked in? For instance, while you feel your church is homey and everyone knows each other, without clear security safeguards, guests may find those same areas creepy, or worse yet, unsafe. Nope. See you in worship. The problem is church isn't a country club. It's a place for broken people to come together and become a family. <clears throat> Sermon starting. Gotta be quick. Shh. In his new book, Tom Rayner has a game plan for making churches more hospitable. In all his years of consulting churches and analyzing research, he's developed a resource to help church members understand their role in becoming a welcoming church. Hey, Rayner guides readers toward a practical framework for making a difference in the lives of those that visit their churches. Shh. Churches can use becoming a welcoming church to understand and audit where they are on the spectrum between welcoming and wanting. Also, don't be boring. Check the book out, it's in there. 